Hi there, students. To keep a tight rein on someone, or to keep a tight rein on something, okay, to have a lot of control over. Okay, the rein are these leather straps that you hold a horse by, and a tight rein. So, to keep a tight rein on something, to keep very close control over something. So, um, strict parents keep a very tight rein on their children. Um, my mother always kept a very tight rein on me. Um, okay, if you want to balance your budget, you need to keep a very tight rein on your budget. So, to maintain strict control over someone, yeah, or to, to uh, keep tight control over something, not to allow it very much independence, very much um, autonomy. Um, okay, so... Um, He's very profligate with money, and his wife therefore keeps a very tight rein on him. Um, he can be a little bit irresponsible, although he can also be a lot of help, and you need to keep a tight rein on him. We need to keep a tight rein on our spending. Yeah, like that, we we will we will um, have enough to go on holiday. Um, a, a very strict manager keeps a very tight rein on his workers. It's not nice working in an office where the boss has a very tight rein on you, on you, because it, it means they don't trust you. Yeah, um, you could keep a tight leash on somebody as well. Yeah, but a to to keep a tight rein on somebody to uh, keep them controlled to. Uh, exercise a lot of control over them to keep them in check not to allow them the freedom to do exactly what they want um yeah the government is spending too much too much money they need to rein in their spending and keep a tight rein on it otherwise um there's going to be a huge budget deficit okay so uh, to keep to keep a tight rein on to limit something to control it particularly spending but it can be you could keep a tight rein on every part of a process um yeah somebody people who micromanage want to keep a, uh, such a tight rein on everything that uh, effectively they do e e e everything um uh, a teacher a teacher ought to keep a tight rein on the students in, in in class particularly 12 13 year olds a class of 12 or 13 year olds really does need um to ha need a teacher to keep a tight rein otherwise you'll 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 get into all sorts of problems okay so to control carefully to limit yeah keep a tight rein on spending keep a tight rein on uh your expenditure um uh I want you to concentrate on what you're doing. I want you to keep a very tight rein on your thinking. Yeah, and like that, you will uh, do something very well. Okay, so uh, to keep a tight rein on something. Um, when there there is a recession, people need to keep a very tight rein on their finances. Otherwise, they're going to get into all, all sorts of problems. Um, I guess... Uh, it's not it's not easy to keep a tight rein on your dreams because you can dream anything yeah um but you need to keep a tight rein on your activities or what you do um a tight rein on spending in times of austerity yeah um a uh, a tight if you're a diabetic you need to keep a tight rein on the amount of of uh sugar in your blood yeah okay so Formality. Keep a tight rein on something. 4.5 in formality. Use informally, use in the semi-formal conversation, use in the semi-formal writing. In something very formal, keep a tight rein on. 
maybe just, but I think probably uh, some a semi-formal writing's the, the maximum. And um, as I said, you are keeping a tight rein. This is like you're riding a horse and you have the reins, the, these leather straps in your hand. And if you keep these very tight, you have a lot of control over what the horse does. Yeah, if you have them loose, then the horse is more independent. And, and that's the idea of it. So enough. If you enjoyed the video, give it a rating, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you soon. Bye for now, to keep a tight rein on.